What if an underwater supervolcano erupted beneath the ocean? Beneath the ocean's calm surface, monsters sleep. Not mythical beasts, but ancient giants made of molten rock. Supervolcanus. Hidden beneath miles of water, they lie silent for thousands of years until one day, they don't. If one of these deep-sea titans erupts, it could change life on Earth in a matter of hours. Let's dive into a nightmare too massive to survive. Let's start with the first blow, a silent explosion more powerful than war. When magma trapped beneath the seafloor bursts free, it doesn't roar it erupts with pressure that water cannot contain. Millions of gallons of ocean flash to steam, exploding outward with the force of countless nuclear bombs. But the real terror comes after the silence, when the shockwaves strike. Now picture this, the ocean itself rising like a monster. That pressure wave won't just vanish. It will shove the sea into motion, birthing tsunamis so massive they tower like moving cities. Within hours, waves will slam into coastlines thousands of miles away. There will be no time to escape and no mercy for what lies in their path. Here comes the invisible killer, the sea turns to poison. As lava pours out, it releases gases trapped from millennia sulfur, carbon, chlorine. These turn the ocean into acid. Fish suffocate. Coral melts. Entire food chains collapse. And the toxic clouds don't stop at the waves, they rise into the air. Above us, the skies go to war with the sun. Ash and gas are blasted high into the atmosphere where they hang like a curtain. The sunlight fades, temperatures drop, crops die in silence. What begins underwater doesn't stay there, it follows us onto land, twisting the weather and stealing the seasons. And deep below, the earth begins to tear itself apart. The eruption rips open fault lines, shaking the ocean floor with quake after quake. New vents open, old ones collapse. Undersea cables snap, power grids fail. We're cut off just when we need connection most. We think the ocean brings peace, but beneath its surface, ancient giants wait in silence. If even one awakens, the world we know will drown in fire and ash, not from above, but from below. And the worst part? We still don't know how many are out there or how close they are to rising.